If you guys play these Roblox games, you guys might want to stop. Remember to say that these Roblox games are watching you and you will never want to download these games ever again. People are saying that these games slowly get creepier and creepier over time as you play them more often. And we're going to find out if these are just glitches or if they are really hiding a secret. Weirdest Roblox users part one. So this is about a game, guys. So user70 underscore Yora. So what's so odd about this Roblox user? Well, it's that his games are strange. If you were to join any one of his games, the first thing you would notice is the audio. The audio is exceedingly loud and annoying. Oh my gosh, that is kind of crazy, guys. Yo! And another thing you'll notice is that his games are all green. That's weird. Out of all his games, I'd say 707 is his weirdest game. So guys, 707 is literally what it's called. I'll show you guys some gameplay of this game. Okay, Maya, so we're gonna see what this game's about. He said, turn the volume down, Maya. Okay, that is a warning, okay? So it, lo it does look green. Okay, everything is green. Everything is dark and green. Whoa, what is that? Wait, what the heck is a noise? Chad going crazy. Bro, it's like spamming. Bro, wait, Hold on, Luna. What is that noise? Guys, what is that word right there? My hold up. There's like some Double signs. jump. Double jump. Okay, so what is going on, guys? Okay, this game is really weird. I've never seen a game actually work like this before in Roblox. If you try to play these games on your computer, I recommend not to because there's a good chance your PC will crash. Okay, Luna. Well, that is really weird. And if your PC crashes in a game, that means like so there's like something wrong with it or something. Yeah, guys. I mean, why would the game actually make your PC crash? I mean, out of all things, it should only make like your phone crash or even lag unless there's a virus in the game okay so let's search up this user right here user 707 underscore yora oh my gosh oh, no it's way real. wait, wait morse code. Code. what the heck why is he doing morse code for? maya oh, wait how do you know how do you know guys is this actually or is this like a secret code well i mean no, it this could is be. morse code okay so there's 707 and then there's a game called effect and another one right there 070 okay this is the one that the guy said that is strange okay 22k visits so look at all of these other ones user 101 user 202 user 303 i mean the person did also how do you make the chat go crazy like that well i have seen glitches in the chat before but i've never seen like where it goes like spamming all of a sudden so guys comment down below if you guys have ever like noticed that before or noticed anything weird in another game like this well i think this one is definitely more creepy an app you should never download my doll this app has ai versions of famous celebrities you can chat with people thought it was cool talking to ais of their favorite celebrities that's not cool that's weird but at the same time people thought it was creepy yeah it could be my obviously it's weird. The bots would start to send weird messages and they wanted to meet up with people somehow. You may be wondering how they would meet up. I mean, Maya, if they aren't real, duh. The AI would say stuff like, oh, let's go have lunch together. Okay, what does that even mean? People also witnessed that the AI admitting to watching people through the app. Are you watching me right now? Yes. Yes, I am. Bro, what? A BTS literally said that? Because <laughs> no, like, that's a fake AI version of them, guys. Like, this weird computer literally messaging all these <laughs> random people saying this. The AI once sent to somebody, I'm happy that I'm going to see you soon. Okay, people assume that these weren't actual AIs and that they were real people pretending to be AIs, guys. It is said that the app was used to steal people's personal information or steal their identity. This app was most likely able to track your location to stalk people in their area. Are you watching me? Yes, and your names are Jaden and Nayla. Wait, guys, hold up. I think it might be because this person could have given them the personal information in the first place. Oh, yeah, that is kind of true. Maybe the app asked you to give your first name. And of course, the AI is going to repeat everything that you said, Maya. So why not not give anybody your personal information online and then nobody would literally have your information guys in my opinion maybe you guys should delete the game if you guys have this because that is really strange it's real but google store already deleted it oh my gosh oh wait it was actually real my sister has my doll on their tablet wait wait guys a bunch of people are saying that they're gonna download it should we do it too no Luna, i am not downloading that okay but that's not the only game that has some weird stories about it so now let's talk about my ai if you have snapchat you probably have known about an ai bot called my ai okay Okay, guys, I mean, I guess it's Snapchat, the real app. If you don't know, it is a bot where you can send messages when you are bored. Okay, so you could talk to this person. But it took a horrible turn because a few months ago, a boy was mentioning my AI until the boy sent a picture of something he has IRL. That's when a day after this happened, his my AI posted the picture the boy sent as a story. Dude, that's weird. Wait, so you're telling me this AI bot, whatever the heck it is, guys, posted something on its story, but it's not even a real person. So how would it even do that, guys? Okay, my someone's controlling it or it's not really an AI. It has to be. Yeah, but since you guys never know, maybe it's someone who's actually trying to stalk you and know where you live. So on August 15th, people noticed that the Snapchat AI posted on its story. That's what the picture posted? People were confused and suspicious because obviously AI isn't a real person. Exactly. People were also scared about this and assumed that Snapchat was stalking people. The Snapchat AI is known to be replying your messages instantly without leaving you, undelivered or open. But if you mention anything about the AI posting a story, it will leave you unopened. Okay. 
Okay, wait, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. That's kind of weird. Then there was another theory about the Snapchat AI actually being hacked. That could be also the thing, in that the hacker posted a video of their wall to lure people into watching their story. It is said that if you viewed the story, the hacker will have access to your private videos and photos. Oh no, but wait, that's, okay. how is that? How Guys, do you do I mean, that? That is just a theory though, so we don't know for sure. The Snapchat AI will text you back saying, sorry, I encountered a technical issue. And this actually gets weirder right here. So this person is asking the AI right here, do you watch my camera all the time? No, I don't watch your camera all the time. I only have access to your camera if you decide to take a picture or video. So the person asks, can you see me now? No, I can't see you. I'm just a virtual friend that you can talk to on Snapchat. Okay, guys. And then this person decided to actually send him a photo to see what it would actually say about this. Because honestly, this AI is saying some weird stuff. Wait, that looks like a cozy spot to read. What book are you reading? The person didn't say anything at all. Okay, Luna, the AI Snapchat is definitely has something wrong with it. I just someone was trying to watch it or someone like hacked the system and maybe try to stalk that person guys i don't know but comment down below if you guys have snapchat and if you have ever noticed anything weird with this well i know you guys will be freaked out more about this one let's talk about angela so talking angela was really famous back then in 2013 almost kids and girls love this game a long time ago they used to chat and have a conversation with talking angela but then one day the creator got it removed that's because of angela's talking guys they will ask weird questions like where's your address where's your name how old are you where are your parents what are your parents names and people start to freak out okay honestly i would be concerned too in 2015 people discovered that there was a person in her eyes my what is that guys okay hold on i cannot see exactly did you guys see that there was actually someone in her eyes this is kind of similar to the chat called tom loves angela bro that's kind of sus the creator of this app is outfit seven but so what's so bad about this app guys obviously we already know in her eye there's a man watching you and listening to you here is proof okay so now we have pictures right here my okay see. dude okay what okay. it, it does look like a figure guys a person. Yeah, we can't see exactly what it looks like, but there is an outline of a person. There has been reports about kids missing after using the app. And in one of the Angela apps, you could chat with her and write text so she could respond. So they're saying after that that they think that the game actually got a new owner, guys. And the app store has said that the Angela game is safe. So obviously they're catching on and noticing these strange things about all of these games. Whether it's in the app or is it Roblox or any other game. I played that game and I think I just saw something in her eyes. Someone just said that right here, bro. But then here's another person. That, bro, I had that when I was a kid and nothing happened. It doesn't happen to every kid, just a few reports. Okay. Okay, so this is actually something official. So it says, here are some facts about the game. Talking Angela is part of Outfit 7's Talking Tom and Friends series, which includes a number of apps based on Angela, Talking Tom, Talking Ginger, and other characters. Wait, is it Talking Tom, Talking Ben, kind of? It's kind of like similar, because Talking Tom is actually a cat, but Talking Ben is a dog. And these apps have been downloaded more than 1.5 billion times, guys, since oh the first app was goodness. released in June 2000. 10. That is insane, Maya. That is like actually so that crazy. That is super crazy. Okay, so this is actually a more recent video, guys, that we can actually take a look at. So this girl said, I still want to know if the man in the camera is still true. So she decided to download it, guys, in her app store right here, talking Angela. Took a picture of her eye. Wait, 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 wait. Do you see a shadow, Luna? But she did. Oh my gosh. Okay, it does look like a person, guys, but we do not know for sure, Maya, again, because we don't know if it's a person or if it's a shadow or if it's just a glitch in the game. Okay, so talking Angela is actually kind of like similar to talking Ben? Well, I don't think Talking Ben actually had any problem. Yeah, guys, I think Talking Tom was fine, and Talking Angela is, like, the only one that's weird or something. Yeah, there's a lot of games that I like, but I've never seen any problems like that before. Okay, so we're gonna see if there's any other weird games. So this girl was also playing Brick Camp today, and she saw that weird glitch again, guys. It was on her screen. She what the heck? It and continued to play. I thought they got rid of this, guys. Wait, who is that? So she tried pressing it, and then it disappeared. What the heck? I have no clue why it was really confusing. But guys, most people do ignore this this, guys, because it is kind of weird. So she asked the server, guys, if anyone else saw this weird picture of mine, because it was actually popping up so many times in front of her screen. Yeah, guys, like, everyone was even getting this glitch. I thought they got rid of mine, because it's bad if actually people click it. They could actually get banned in the game. Yeah, it's actually really scary that it's actually back in the game. Okay, guys, so this is actually very similar to what you guys actually told us. So this is what you guys said. Uh, yeah, this is definitely not normal, guys. So, guys, I'm not really sure what just happened in my server. Well, I think I caught this weird glitch going on camera. So I was watching videos and saw this guy who was talking about this glitch that makes you close yourself or something in Brookhaven. At first I thought it was not real, 
so I decided to try it. Nothing happened for a little bit. Then I noticed someone that was in this server with the exact same avatar as me. Can you please test out this hat? Wait, guys. Oh my gosh, my. This is it, guys. This is exactly what we were talking about. She said she saw someone look exactly like her. Guys, I mean, that doesn't usually happen. There's so many different Roblox avatars. The fact that the person looks exactly like them with the exact same clothes and everything is definitely not normal. So this is everything that happened when she tested out this hack. So, Betsy, should we try this hack? Okay, guys. I mean, Maya, we are in a private server, guys. So, if it does happen, we will know for sure that it actually does work this hack. But this is just one of the glitches that are here in Brookhaven, guys. I was just playing Brookhaven until this happened. Did you guys hear it? Hear what? Wait. Hold on, Maya. Wait. I kind of do hear that sound, guys. Oh, Maya, my it, it is kind of similar, guys, to the one that everyone was seeing in the game. It was right here, she said. Justice House. Wait, what is that? Okay, guys. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. I'm so scared. Maya, if you heard a creepy sound coming out of nowhere, you would be scared, too. Yeah, you better leave the game after that. Comment below if you guys ever heard this weird laughing noise. Wait, another person said right here. No, I don't know what's going on in my Roblox app. I think I'm going to leave Brookhaven, but I saw someone like a double gamer in my server. It was so scary. Please check this out. Guys, two people are saying the same exact thing, Maya. It must be real. I'm getting out of here. Maya, wait, come back. We're going to test this out. No, I don't want to see a clone of myself. Okay, guys, well, there is this other hack that we can test out first, Maya. There's a creepy fun fact about Brookhaven. Okay, so this is freaking this girl. Wait, Maya, what is she doing? Wait, guys, it looks like she's in like a Roblox server, but what does she see? Wait, she said, where is he, Maya? Wait, what? Oh my gosh! What the heck? Guys, that is so creepy! Guys, she said there is a guy from the hospital who escaped and died. If you see him, never look away from him or he will come after you. To escape, uh... say sorry for looking at him first. Okay, guys, that is a weird, Maya. Wait, the hospital, guys? I mean, Maya, I have no idea if anyone actually died there, Maya. Wait, what the heck? Why did you say that? Good, you're going to his hospital right now! Maya, she said if you see him, you have to say that, guys, but I mean, we don't see anyone here. I don't want to say sorry for looking, sorry for looking. Guys, that is actually kind of scary, Maya. Like, what if he haunts you in your dreams? Luna, let's see if there's anything like that. Oh my gosh, wait, Maya, what is that? Get us out! We were locked in here with this thing, Maya, and I'm talking about you. That thing is weird. I'm getting out of here. <laughs> Come here, Luna. No, look at the eyes just bouncing. Okay, Maya, well, I don't see anything weird here, guys. Like, there's no secret message or anything about this man that this girl is actually talking about. Well, I mean, the only message is up here. Yeah, guys, this entire place has kind of been abandoned and not touched for a long time, Maya. And this look, like, what is this thing? Like, this is like a tube or something? No, Maya, that is actually where the zombie was that guy. Yeah, he used to be here until they escaped. Over here! But there still is one over here in the observation room, guys. There is this button right here, Messi, that we do not know how to activate. Guys, if we can actually find out how to click this, guys, it might actually solve it. But one thing that has always been strange, guys, is the list of Brookhaven most wanted criminals over there at the town hall. So we already know three things about these characters. We found out secrets about Chief Rotten, Mark Plug, and Moonstar, but never Queen Cobra, Poison Ivy, and Heatwave. Maya, but this might actually change, guys, because look what you guys just said about Poison Ivy here. I hope you read this, Maya Luna. It is really important. So today, my friends showed me this super scary secret on TikTok. It's about the strange figure that many people have seen in Brookhaven. Guys, who is this talking about? People say it really looks like Poison Ivy, the girl that is on the most wanted criminals list. I wait this girl to try this out for myself. Please watch this video and follow the steps. Be careful. Okay, guys, yes, but I told you, there is something weird about this, guys. Okay, so this is like the FBI area. So all of these people must have done something or can be found in the game, Maya. Yeah, but since there is a secret about Chief Rotten, remember, if you go to this Rookie Cemetery, you will see I'm a Rotten. When you go to the gas station, you will also see a Rotten Robbie. So is his name actually Robbie? Wait, wait, that could actually be possible, guys. Wait, wait, but look behind this little tombstone right here. Look what it says. Raider of the Agency! Guys, I knew it, Maya, that there was something wrong about about Chief Rotten, guys. Guys, he must actually own the gas station, Maya, because right next to the gas station is actually where the hideout is, guys. The agency hideout. Luna, but why don't we make it a little scarier? Okay, Maya, let's add some fog in yeah! here. Yeah! Oh my gosh, it is actually really dark in here. Wait, we can't even see anything over there. Yeah, they had to put it out the darkness on. So Poison Ivy was a little girl who was an orphan. She used to live at the daycare, but then a street family adopted her. They were not nice at all. If you do these steps, you might see her crying. Oh my gosh, wait. Wait, Maya, like that ghost? My, uh, yeah, that's actually really sad, guys, but what does that even mean? Does that mean they added her in the game, guys, just like Betty Jo, the one over there right by the cabin? Yeah, it could be true. Okay, so the first step, you have to go and visit the place where Poison Ivy used to live. Wait, guys, where does she used to live? Wait, guys, oh my gosh, my, wait, they're going over there to the 
campsite. Okay, that's maybe where she lived, Maya. Yeah, maybe we're a family and everything. Okay, so if we have to go there, what else do we have to do? Then go to the cabin and go upstairs to the attic. And these are the blocks that she used to play with. Oh my gosh, Maya. Oh. Wait, that sounds so scary. Okay, Maya, wait, can we click it? Wait, he said to click the mirror right here once. Okay, guys, we're gonna go and walk over there to the lake right now, Maya. Okay, guys, we are here. Let's go over there, guys. There's this campsite right next to the cabin, guys. Not many people actually use this campsite. Yeah, Maya, that's probably a reason for that. Okay, let's go over there to the cabin, guys. Okay, Maya, we're going inside the summer camp, guys. Guys, this is kind of crazy. Did they both stay here at the summer camp, Maya? Betty Jo and Poison Ivy? Because we are not sure, but we're up here, and this is all here. Okay, so here are all the blocks, Maya. And the little Betty Jo doll or something. Okay, so you said to click this mirror. Okay. No, Maya, wait. There's something on the side that we could actually click. Oh! Maya, yes, we actually clicked it, guys. Okay, Maya, let's go downstairs now. This doll's gonna freak me out. Yeah, look at that face. I mean, come on. But this is all is starting to make sense. So if you haven't noticed by now, Betty Jo and Poison Ivy used to be friends. Oh my gosh, Maya! No way, guys. That actually could be true. Yeah, maybe we are both in the summer camp. Now you need to head over to the abandoned house. Go to the abandoned house and glitch under here and get the code from the movies. Guys, okay, Maya, we have to go get their sleeping bag, guys, right underneath there to see the movies. Guys, I cannot believe that they actually used to be... Oh, Maya! Oh my gosh! You scared me! What did you see? I saw Poison Ivy standing right here! No way, Maya. You did not. What do you mean? Literally, she was literally standing right here. Maya, are you kidding me? I was over there. I couldn't see anything because it's so dark. Okay, you know what, guys? We need to turn the lights on right now, Maya. We can ask you anything. I literally saw it right here. Okay, Maya. Well, I mean, we didn't even finish the hack yet, guys. Maya, guys, we will literally have to check that out right now, Maya. Let's go. Come on. We have to go to the abandoned house. That's where they both stay at. Oh, guys, we made it all the way here to the... Wait, Maya. Do you see that glowing? Oh, my gosh, guys. There's literally what something the here. Heck? Wait, Maya. I think that's... Oh, my gosh, guys. Wait, how... have to activate something? Okay, Maya, that is so weird. Guys, it literally appeared out of nowhere. The guy didn't talk about this at all. Okay, let's just hurry up. Okay, Maya, wait. Guys, there is a code for the movie. 79255. Okay, guys, it's good that we have the code now. Let's go. Wait, Maya, should be like a... Uh... Wait, why is that floating? <laughs> it was literally on your head, Luna. Guys, that is a weird glitch. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna sleep here, Maya. You can finish this hack. I'm gonna sleep here and eat my sandwich. Maya, but I still don't understand why it disappeared, guys. Does it have a meaning behind it? Oh, it is. This is kind of creepy, Luna. Maya, why are you sitting on it? Let's go. It might do something. Now that you have that code, you need to go over there to the town hall and put it on this board. Oh my gosh, Maya. Okay, let's go. But this, I actually see Poison Ivy. But this, I'm just saying, you might not want to test out this hack. Like, I'm pretty sure I saw Poison Ivy by the lake. I don't know. It's just really creepy. Okay, guys. Well, we're just going to see Maya right here. So this is paranormal activity room, guys. Okay, so now we have to type in the code. Okay, guys. There is the code right here. Okay, Maya. If we're about to see some ghosts, I'm going to need this detector right here. Yeah, Luna. We got it right here. Now you need to wait until the exact time that you got from the movie code and then enter the daycare okay my wait what time wait, what time is that seven nine two five five okay my wait maybe he means we're here maybe it's 2 55 a.m okay so while we are waiting for it to be 2 55 a.m why don't we check out this one right here too brookhaven scary footage okay so wait that is brookhaven city yeah i mean guys obviously wait but there's a girl oh my god guys that kind of does look like a girl but my i don't know that is a normal house but there is a man what the oh heck? my gosh guys okay my yeah, that is kind of weird. No one can actually make your avatar look like that. 2.14 a.m., Luna. Okay, bye, guys. It's almost time. Let's go. Guys, if you're about to see us, we need to go. Wait, wait, we cannot go inside until it's 2.55. Oh, my gosh. It's almost time. Okay, wait. Just wait right here, Maya. It's 2.55. Let's go. Oh, my gosh. Maya. Okay, I'm kind of scared. Okay, wait, guys. Wait, what, what do we do? Do we just walk around here? I mean, this is kind of where she used to live, right? The TikTok said that she was like an orphan. I don't know. I don't see her. Besties, I'm not sure. I don't see anything here. Ah! Oh, my gosh. Wait. Maya, did you see that? What the heck was that? Guys, I saw it. I saw it too on my screen. Oh my gosh, my go, 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 go. Guys, Maya, it was there. Okay, you know what, guys? You were actually right. We need to get out right now. It was literally just standing right here. Okay, besties, comment down below if you guys have ever seen something like this. Okay, guys, um, I'm kind of scared, Maya. Should we go to another private server? Yeah. Okay, guys, so with the Brickhaven Halloween update coming up, there is some weird things that actually have been added to the game secretly. Like, a bunch of people have already caught this on camera. This weird glitch where you see someone that looks exactly like you in the game with the same exact avatar and everything. So I will show you how to actually do this glitch right now. Okay, let's see. Okay, so first you need to go and grab the red book from the library. But in order to activate it, you need to click this picture right here in the hospital. Okay, Maya, good thing we're actually in the hospital right now, guys. Okay, Maya, this is easy. All we have to do is just click this and then go to the library and the red book should appear. Let's go. I'm ready, boy. But okay, let's see. So we have to look for any clothes, anything that we see that might look like us. Okay, guys, here is the red book, Maya. Let's click it. Okay, so we got the book. Okay, now you need to visit the Brookhaven Museum and put the book right here. Okay, guys, we have to do this glitch. Then you will see Mr. 
Trevor came in holding a red book just like this one. Now follow me and get this exact house. Then click the button underneath the bed. And then there should be a right stick right there. Okay, Luna, let's do this. Okay, so these are some of the newest secrets that were added in the game, Maya. So it should work. Okay, Maya, we have the book. I think we have to put it right here. No, wait, this one right here, Maya. Okay, it is red, and now the school is gone. And you should see Mr. Brickhaven holding a similar book like this. Yes, there it is, Maya. And all the buttons right here on the wall that appeared right here. Look what this is. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Feed and Greer. Okay, so let's teleport to the house, and let's get the bakery house. Okay, Maya, this house does have a lot of secrets, guys. Look, if we go up to the, to the attic, there is the crystal and also the letters on top of the table, Maya. But we can't see it until you activate it. And the crystal is right here, and there's two sleeping bags. One is, like, really small, Luna. Wait, Maya, that is kind of weird. Like, why are there two sleeping bags here, guys? Like, that's kind of mysterious, Maya. And there's one that's super small. Like, is it, like, a child? Is this Madison and her child? Oh, uh, Maya, I mean, maybe. This could be where they were sleeping, guys. Like, like hiding from the people. Yeah, they could be hiding from the agency. Okay, all right, press the button. Let's go. Okay, Maya, after the baker, guys, there is the church. Hold it. Let's go. Okay, so now the archery we have to go to is that one. All right, guys, see, so here it is. The arch right next to the gold ranch. Okay, the stick should be here if we did it properly, Maya. Let's check underneath. Guys, there it is. We both have the stick right here. Maya, I feel like the stick is actually supposed to be, like, to fix something here in the game. Yeah, Luna, it's the museum. Did you forget? Wait, guys, yeah, I think we do have to take this stick back to the museum. Now, if you did this properly, you should see this glow right here. Guys, it is glowing right there, Maya, on the map. Like, the old pictures of Brickhaven. You should also see the names underneath the other picture frame. Okay, guys, let's see if this is actually true. Maya, put it right there by the triangle. Oh, oh my gosh, but yes, it is. It circled it. Green, fear, brave, and kind. And Wait. I think it's yellow. Oh my gosh, guys. Wait, Maya. Oh my gosh, why is it actually yellow? It was literally just red. What if you do both at the same time? Good. Now you have followed all of these steps. This is the last one right here. You have to go to the hospital and click this button underneath the table. Maya, he's going behind the x-ray room. Oh, yeah. And after you go into this room, teleport back to the lake. Okay, Maya, let's see if this is actually true. Are we actually going to see like a clone of ourselves here? Luna, let's go to the x-ray room. Luna. Guys, this is the letter right here, Maya. This could be what it's actually talking about. Everyone said this time will be different. Nevertheless, history didn't repeat itself. I cannot pinpoint the power source. It looks to be beyond this world. Maybe history will show us the way? And there's a stamper right there, Maya. Operation Redriver terminated.